how you doing, Doug Johns? Good. Good, this is Doug and this is, hey, this is Jocko 3X, we're here in Detroit. You don't look like Jocko. No, I'm the other one. Oh, are I'm you the, the other, other one? one or is, can't play. Is he the other one? He's the one you don't need a Ouija board to contact. Right. <laughs> hey, Ooh. Bill Clements, how are you? <laughs> hey, we got A.V. Warner, drummer. And Jay making some noise. Somewhere. What's going on here, Detroit Bass Fest 2012? Detroit. Lester Collie's putting this on. It was, uh, awesome. it was a great success last time, and we're coming back, and it's going to be a blast. Well, Nate Watts. Nate Watts. Nate Watts is yeah. performing tonight. Wow. Bill Clements, yeah. myself, and Doug Jones. And we're here in Detroit. Jocko, what, what have you been up to since we last spoke? Oh, playing, working on a new CD, the same old routine, and starving. <laughs> a little bit, starving a little bit. Uh, how about you, Doug? You look, you look well fed. Oh, yes, we, we got a. <laughs> oh, thank you. We got a brand new CD called Blum. Called and what? And actually, this is the debut gig that we're uh, releasing the CD. So, to speak. give me the title again. Blum. Spell it. B L O M P. Just like it sounds. Like James. Blum. <laughs> there you go. Well, you you have uh, Doug Johns. You have pocket full of nasty. You have stank, stank and blomp and blomp now. So it, uh, how is blomp different from the other three? Uh, you know, I, I, I can honestly say it's more funky. It's, it's more funky. even more yeah. funky, yeah. if that's possible, huh? What are you gonna do for us here today? At uh, we're gonna do some uh, some from pocket full of nasty. We're gonna do a couple tunes from stank, a little bit from blomp, a little bit of everything. Right. We're trying some new stuff. I got this new drummer. I don't know where he went. He left me already. But Drummers. Jay Sims, so I'm looking forward to playing with him. All yeah. right. You have a message for the followers of ForBassPlayersOnly.com? Yeah, that's where you go if you want to know anything about bass. Isn't that right, John? Hey, that's one of the most informative outlets out there today on the Internet when it comes to bass guitar, acoustic bass guitar. That's true. Anything bass guitar. For BassPlayersOnly.com. Seriously, check it out when you get a chance. I'm sorry, what was that name again? For BassPlayersOnly.com. Did, did you get that, though? What was that Bass, name? For BassPlayersOnly.com. Okay. We are with Bill Clements here at uh, where, where? Detroit Bass Fest 2012 in Detroit. How you doing, Bill? Uh, it's, it's great to be here in Detroit for the Detroit Bass Fest. So tell, tell us what you've been up to. You're in Kalamazoo, right? Yep, uh, doing a lot of uh, doing a lot of gigging around town, uh, splitting my time up between money making cover gigs and uh, intrinsically rewarding jazz fusion gigs that are only intrinsically rewarded. Okay. Now we did an interview uh, not too long ago on ForBassPlayersOnly.com. That was earlier this year, 2012. Tell us what you've been up to since. Well, honing my honing my skills, of, as, of course, as always, and the aforementioned money gigs. Also, been uh, talking with Regenerate Guitar Works, and it's looking like they're going to do a Bill Clements model bass here, based on the uh, red bass that I'm playing these days. And when will we know something for sure? You're going to let that. Uh... Prior to Nam, I think they're going to do. Uh, uh, some sort of little uh, release. Prior to NAM 2013. Yes, which I plan on attending. All right. Well, now what about uh, Detroit Bass Fest, where we are now? What do you have in store for us here? What's going on? Well, I've brought a lovely little uh, drummer and sax player who's going to be uh, uh, joined by a keyboard player from here in Detroit, that Ryan Gadotti, that I jammed with some years ago, Pete, who's fabulous, and uh, just going to set the controls for the Heart of the Sun and unleash the Fusion Nightmare. Any message for the uh, followers of ForBassPlayersOnly.com? Stay tuned. There you go. Come, you're in Detroit Bass Fest right now, and you just came back from Lugano, Switzerland, Madrid, Spain, Kiev in the Ukraine, and one of my favorite places, Sarajevo, Bosnia Herzegovina. And who are you playing with over there? Miles Miles, the All Star Miles Davis Band, which has in it Joey D. Francesco on the organ, the world famous, the fantastic, the magnificent. The great, my old friend, we've been talking about this for 30 years, Larry Coriel on the guitar. We have on the drums, Omar Hakim. You know, he one of the top drummers in the country. And on trumpet, the man who has Miles Davis horns, Miles Tartum, Wallace Roney, 
on the saxophone, Rick Margetza. Detroit and, boy. And the pot, that's right. It's from the D. Right. The day. And the pots are on. And Any you, other questions? And you came back to be at this event, which is? The Detroit Bass Fest, the second annual. We need sponsors. We need money. We need the business, the community to sponsor this stuff. Because we're trying to keep Detroit positive and cosmopolitan because this is the greatest city in the world. <laughs> oh, that's right. We got to ask the mayor. Hi, mayor. <laughs> <laughs>